Say, good morning. Good morning. Say, we're going to the water park. The water park. Say, universal. Universal. Yeah, high five. Vamos a pasarla bien, vamos a pasarla bien, vamos a pasarla bien, vamos a pasarla bien, esta noche, vamos a pasarla bien, esta noche, vamos a pasarla bien. What's up, guys? What's up, what's up? What's up? We had a bunch of comments asking for like a present day catch up. So this is your present day catch up. We are back on the boat. We are back to doing projects. I was uh, doing a lot of uh, tiling today. Not real tile, but you'll see in an episode. Really it's pretty cool. cool. We, we just went on an epic cruise. Uh, it was so fun. Yes. Challenge you if you are with your spouse and you guys haven't taken a trip together. Uh, Do it. We waited seven years to take a trip without our kids and it was absolutely wonderful. And now we've done three of them so five far. Five years. Six, five. five years. Whatever. Who's it counting? It felt like 10. Who's counting? <laughs> the three books come out, guys. Um, oh if you don't know about the books, uh, we did one called Ocean's World, which is super cool. It's a kid's book. We also wrote a book called What If Love Is The Point? And, we and then just, a follow-up. We just wrote a book called Love Is The Point. Yes. Uh, it's a 100-day devotional, um, and if you guys want to check it out, we really appreciate it. Uh, something that you can do with your spouse or your friend or just you by yourself. You can do yourself. it solo. I've been getting a lot of questions, like, do you have yeah. to be married or in a relationship? And no, not at all. What else happened? Uh, Kingston peed in our bed last night, that so sucked. that sucked. Yeah, got a little scared mm. in our room last night. Mm -hmm. But, but we did add some brand new sheets today, so I told Lex that no more. Please. Yeah, yeah, we got new sheets. It was good timing on the sheet. Also, just... I'm really proud of us. Three days in a row at the gym. Three, three days in a row at the gym. High five. And now this is the fourth episode in a row. Oh, so let's no. let's get this thing started. Uh, my name is Cross Vega. This is my wife. Lex Vega. And welcome to the show. Let's, let's go! go! It's early. And we are headed to Universal this morning. Everyone is looking cherry. We got a full night's sleep. And we are we are feeling lively. And we are ready. But we're gonna have a lot of fun. And we're all gonna have fun! Regardless, who cares? You know what, tonight, we'll all crash around six o'clock and it'll be fantastic. Okay. We still need to book the hotel, but whatever. We'll book it on the way. Okay guys, so for the last three episodes, we have been uh, getting this boat ready, uh, but it's been a stressful few weeks. So I'm taking the family on a little trip. And Wait, we're going to Universal Studios Orlando, and we're taking you guys with us. Uh, this trip was super fun. Yeah, well as much as I love the boat, I'm telling you, at this time in my life, I could not wait to get away and do something else because it was really that. hard. It was really hard being on I the boat. That. So let's go to Orlando, come on! Uh, we are currently leaving the property and on our way to our final destination. Yeah. Have you never been there? No. You've never been to Islands of Adventure? Never. Oh my gosh. I Have you Guava? Oh my gosh. Have you Ocean? Oh my god. How about you, Kingston? No! Rio? Okay, Rio, okay, Rio's been there. Well, this is gonna be an exciting day because my family has never been to Islands of Adventure. I used to go there as a kid all the time. Ocean, I'm so excited to see how many rides you can go on. There's a Jurassic Park world and all the dinosaurs are there. Are they robot dinosaurs with no people in them? I don't know. We're gonna have to see if they're robot dinosaurs or real dinosaurs. No, no. Yeah, yes, Kingston. Yes, we're going there. Yeah, it's too dark. Well, it's gonna get lighter as we get closer. Did I ever tell you about when my mom took us to San Diego? No. It is the best memory I have of my childhood. Wait, guys, it really the is. best. Are you, are you hearing this right now? This is, I, if I Baba, this is the best, best memory. memory. Oh this my is. Gosh, I'm you guys. So honored. Your words are very powerful. I'm so serious. Please. If we were to call my siblings and you ask them, like, what their favorite memory is, like, a kid, other than, like, playing dress up together and stuff like that, what was, like, the most, the best trip they've ever taken? It would have, it would have been this well, right here. Up. Let's hear so, it. Uh, I'm excited. Are you mom, excited, Guava? Yeah, I'm so excited. <laughs> Shut up, Arlo. My mom packed our bags the night before, just like we did for our kids. I didn't even put two and two together until we're in this car right I'm now. Cr I'm crying already. And she surprised us the next morning. We had no idea what was happening, but uh, she got us in the car while it was dark out and drove us to the train station, and she left us. No, I'm just kidding. She drove us to the train station and um, we took our first train ever to San Diego uh, to go to the San Diego Zoo. 
and we literally spent the whole day running around the park. It was the most incredible thing ever. My mom had never surprised us like that before. What? And nothing like, happened? Like a, like a, like a tiger not... didn't escape or anything? Like, no, like it was oh. just a beautiful family moment. That, oh, that's like, beautiful. That was... Those are like magical moments. Like the fact that our kids are like, why are we going to the park now? Because it's dark. They're gonna remember we woke up yeah. before the sun so Mommy and daddy were too cheap to get a hotel the night before, that's oh why. God. Actually, we could probably call Mackie right now because she's awake in Australia. And we'll ask her what the most meaningful yeah. trip we ever took. All right, us. fact check, fact check that. Fact check it, sisters. Maybe she's not picking up oh. because it was gonna be a lie and it wasn't gonna be. <gasps> If she says that that's her most memorable trip with her family, I will cry, because that's beautiful. First stop, hour 45 left. Guys, how did we do for the first stop? Excellent. Ocean, how do you feel, dude? Okay. Is baby bit, sleeping? Robinator's got him. Time to use the restroom. Now we're going straight there. So there's this woman who's amazing named Megan on Maui. We met her at church and whenever we have to film a movie or have to travel or anything, sometimes we'll bring her out with yeah, us and she'll help us out because out. the kids love her. Um, but for a minute there, Kingston was... The kids were all calling her grandma. Grandma. But grandma. they couldn't pronounce grandma. It sounded like Gama, Gama. I didn't want them calling her grandma. I was like, that's weird. So I was like... And she's not old, she's young. So I was like, I, I was like, you mean... Guava? They're like, yes. yes. She started being like, they're calling me Guava. I'm not sure if I like it. And then after like two weeks, she was like, I love it. It's my little nickname. So now we, <laughs> but all, we all call so her now Guava. We all are calling Guava. We're like, hey, Guava. Not her name, but Dude, thanks, Guava. I just realized that. Like, I literally call literally, her Guava. Literally, I'll text her and be like, hey, Guava. <laughs> I'm a 34 year old man <laughs> calling this woman Megan. Guava. Megan, I'm so sorry. We, we know it's not we Guava, but Thank we you. love you so much. You guys see it? Yeah. Do you, do you see the big volcano right there? Yeah. Tomorrow's the water park. Today we're gonna go to the theme park, baby. What's up, dude? Look over there, Daddy. Look. Are, are those minions? Yeah. Are we gonna see the minions today? Yeah, but soon. Hey, Kingston, are you cozy, buddy? Whoa. All right, so we just got here. Rio's ready. If we get through, I'll take it off of him. Rio, are you ready? Listen, only an hour late. It's pretty good. Pretty good for the Pena Vegas. <laughs> so we're meeting Alexa's grandparents here, who she hasn't seen since Ocean was six months. And now we have, well, well two more kids since she's seen us and Ocean's basically a man. I had not seen my grandparents in years and I randomly texted them. They don't live too far from Orlando and I just thought, well, maybe they wanna to go to Universal. They're kind of fun and adventurous like that. And I, I wrote them and sure enough, my Nana was like, heck yeah, we'll be there. We've multiplied since you guys last saw us. What's going on here? What are you doing? You gotta quit having so many damn kids. What are we gonna do? Good gosh almighty. What do you think? I know, he gets, he gets oh, really sorry. shy. He's our craziest shy. Oh, oh my God. God. Ocean, do you see this? Look at all the rides that you can do. I just want to do it. That's more than we thought. Gosh. All right, Kingston, do you want to check how tall you are, buddy? Come on over here. Oh, well, oh, well you oh, know what? Oh. We're going to have a great time with you. Don't you worry, dude. Stand up straight. Your back is a little up. Uh... All right, should we go? Yeah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> What ride are we about to do? Minions. Minions? Are you excited? Are you a little nervous? No. No? He was a little scared. <laughs> Just a little bit. Uh, a little bit scary. A little bit scary? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. Hey, but you tried it, right? Tried. This is Kenneth. Hello. He's going to take us around and make sure that our kids get to do everything because, well, probably won't do this again with the kids for a while. Our, our awesome friend Arnold um, got us a guide. Arnold, if you're watching this. Thank you. Thank you. It's bougie. It's the bougiest once, way to go to Once Universal. you do it, you can't, you can't not do it. We got to basically go on every ride. It's, it's like better than Fast Pass. They take you through the back, you get right there. Yeah. If you want to go again, you just sit and you just go again. Should we try Transformers? Yeah. Yeah? 
Okay, note to self, uh, we're not doing that one again. <laughs> Ocean was terrified. He cried for half of it, and then he smiled for the, for the half, so. Hey, no, come on, come on the back first. Kids love, love, love. How I many is that? Three? Love, 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 love. They're obsessed with dinosaurs. Yeah, but the ah. amount of eggs that I purchased for them to crock open and it's so get all over our house so with that, it's just ah. yeah. Ocean, Ocean loved it. I mean, he legit thought it was real and kept saying that he wanted to go back the next day to feed it. He had to make sure it ate. And in his defense, it really looked real. I really wanted to get him to experience the big one, but I think it might have scared him. Yeah, he would have put the power. The entire day was Velocicoaster. Oh my gosh, Velocicoaster is awesome. I gotta say that's my favorite roller coaster of all time. Easily. Easily. And and we got to go in the front. I think I think you and I went in the front twice. Like back to back. Probably. Yeah, and it was just two was enough. I was like, Yeah, Whoa. you get you get very nauseous actually. Oh. Hey. hey! You look familiar. So did you watch Big Time Rush back in the day? What up? Oh my god! Carlos? Yeah. I've been spotted. Kingston, we've been spotted. 
Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. That about wraps it up here at Universal. Thank you, Universal, for everything. Thank you, Arnold, Uncle Arnold. You're the best, man. We definitely have to come back, but maybe just us and no kids. We are headed to Volcano Bay today. All the kids want to do is go back to the Raptor encounter. But we're gonna go to Volcano Bay. We sit at the Sapphire Falls Hotel. I would have liked to have stayed at this hotel a little longer, more than like 10, 12 hours. Uh, so we could enjoy the pool and just chill, but it's okay. This this trip is for the kids. A little bit for the adults, but mainly for the kids. Whoa, guys, where are we going? So we got to basically just walk from the hotel. So awesome. Whoa, Kingston. Yeah. <laughs> Do you want to go down? No. All right, Kingston, go for it. No, no, no. Okay, come on. One, two, three. All right, Ocean, let's see it, dude. Rob was right at the bottom. One, two, three. Go, 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 go. If you had to pick, okay. If I had to pick, if you had to pick, Universal Studios or Volcano Bay? Volcano Bay. Really? I just like being outside in the sun, and Universal. <laughs> I would still pick Universal. Yeah, I think so. Universal, dude. There's there, there's definitely more to do. They're totally different things. I'm flip flopping. Did you have fun yeah. at Volcano Bay? Yeah. Should we come back again? Yeah. When do you want to come back? Uh, uh, tunnel. The <laughs> tunnel? Yeah. yeah. You mean the bridge? Yeah. Cool. He thinks tunnel. tunnels are bridges and bridges are tunnels. All right, well, can you say I'll, I'll, I'll see you later? Later. Yeah. So, say it. And thank you, Universal. No. Please. Oh, your turn. Okay, thank you, Universal. Okay. Should we go check on Rio? No, we're Guava. And Guava, yes, come on, let's go. We'll definitely be doing this again. This was awesome.